breaking news, breaking news. Mississippi State has fired head coach Zach Arnett less than one year after he replaced the great and legendary Mike Leach. Welcome to episode 330 of College Football's Peek Around the Corner with your host, Greg Flugar. We cover everything in college football because we love everything in college football. And if you do as well, please subscribe to our ever-going channel. Smash the like button. If you like our content, share the video with your family and friends. Let's not waste any more time. Pete Thamel, early this morning, sources, Mississippi State has fired coach Zach Arnett. Greg Knox will serve as, as the school's interim coach per sources. He's twice served as the interim in the past at MSU and at Florida. The buyout for Zach Arnett is nearly $4 million but is subject to offset in mitigation. So it likely won't cost that much, according to Pete Thamel of ESPN. He earned his reputation as a strong defensive coordinator and will have a strong market for his services. There's no question about it. Zach Arnett is gonna be, is he's gonna be on the market. He's gonna have people giving him a call, his agent giving him a call to become their next defensive coordinator. A lot of schools are looking for a new defensive coordinator after the 2023 season. Let's take a look real quick here at CBS report this morning. Miss Mississippi State fires Zach Arnett. The Bulldogs part with coach less than one year after replacing the legendary, the great Mike Leach. The Bulldogs coach went just one and six in conference play during his first season as a full-time boss. Mississippi State has fired head coach Zach Arnett, according to 247 Sports. He compiled a 4-6 and six record, 1-6 and six in the SEC. Senior analyst Greg Knox will serve as the Mississippi State interim coach. We went through that in the Pete Thamel tweets. Arnett was elevated from defensive coordinator to interim coach in 2022, following the untimely death of the legendary Mike Leach. After leading the team to an emotional victory in, in the Olaya Quest Bowl, the administration decided to promote Arnett to full-time coach during the offseason in lieu of conducting a national search for Leach replacement. The move to fire Arnett comes on the heels of a 51-10 loss for Mississippi State to Texas A&M in Week 11. Ironically, Arnett is not the first coach to be fired amid the fallout from that game. On Sunday, Texas A&M made the move to fire Jimbo Fisher despite the convincing win for the Aggies. And here's somebody, uh, Ross Dellinger. Get a load of this. Look at this tweet. Is this the first time in college football history that two head coaches have been fired midseason in the days following the game against one another? Again, Texas A&M beat Mississippi State 51-10. to Last Saturday, Jimbo Fisher out on Sunday, Zach Arnett out on Monday. And after Jim Fisher was fired, my question on the live show last night was, who's next? The next is Zach Arnett. I don't think he was really ever, I don't think Mississippi State ever thought of him as the long-term solution. So who is Mississippi State's next football coach? Who is their possible long-term solution? My idea would be, well, Jamie Caldwell, Coach Liberty, Coach Coastal Carolina. I think it's time for him to take the reins of an SEC program. His family, they've all said he wants to stay in the South. I think it's his time. Liberty, he's only been there for one year, dominating, undefeated. He was with Coastal Carolina, built a great program. I think Jamie Caldwell, I think it's his time. I think he'd be number one on the hot board list, our hot board list for the Mississippi State job. Look, of course, Mississippi State, the job at the bottom, near the bottom of the SEC when it comes to coaching job, when it comes to the value of the position versus the other head coaching positions in the SEC. But it's an SEC job. Money's going to come with it. Um, Life-changing money's going to come with it. You're going to have the resources to build your staff. 
A lot of people are going to be interested. Mississippi State, going to have a decent hot board list. But Mississippi State, I don't think, is the last SCT, SEC team is going to lose their coach. I think Ole Miss is going to lose their coach as well. Not because they're going to fire Lane Kiffin, but, but I think Lane Kiffin is going to be moving on again. Put down your comments and thoughts in the comments section below the video. Who do you think is going to be the next head football coach in Mississippi State? We're sitting here on Monday. Two head coaches gone. More is coming. Stick with us here at PATC as we follow this news across the college football landscape. Until next time, from all of us at PATC to all of you, please, please, you all take great care of each other. Thank you so very much.